The city of West Palm Beach recently announced that one of its most popular streets, Clematis Street, is getting ready for some big improvements. Here with me today to tell us more about this project and how you can get involved is West Palm Beach Mayor Jerry Moyo. Mayor Moyo, thank you so much for being here today. Thank you for inviting me. A very big topic of conversation. The, the project itself is called Clematis Streetscape. What is the improvement all about? <clears throat> Well, you know, as you said, Clematis is our iconic street in West Palm Beach. It's been recognized as one of the iconic streets in the United States, uh, and it needs some sprucing up. So we are looking to add some more shade trees, um, some cafe, more cafe seating, maybe widen the sidewalks, um, do something with the intersections to make them more prominent, uh, and all of all of a lot of different ideas and we're asking the public to come and share with us ideas that they would like to see on Clematis. We're working with Victor Dover who is one of the premier urban designers in the country <clears throat> Excuse me, and um, we want to hear from, from the people who live and work around Clematis Street or who live who visit it from other parts of our city. Where can people leave their feedback? Well, um, on Saturday morning uh, at the Green Market, there will be a booth set up. Uh, the Green Market is from 9 to 1. Uh, there'll be a booth set up there where you can leave your ideas and thoughts and talk to who's ever there and um, learn about some of the ideas that we're contemplating. And then on Monday night at uh, City Hall, there will be an a, a interactive kind of design uh, charrette. And that will begin at 5.30. So you have t two opportunities at this point, Saturday morning and Monday night. Fantastic. And is I know there's a lot of research that goes into projects like this. A lot of times you go and look at other cities around the country to kind of get ideas. Is there any other city that's same size about West Palm Beach that you kind of uh, would like to emanate or maybe stood out to you? Well, you know, I, I, I can't say one city, but we have had... Um, Numerous studies done by outstanding and very well-known um, urban designers who have worked with cities all over the world. And when they come to our city, they bring all that knowledge with them and help us to think about how you know we can continue our goal of becoming a world-class city. Um, so you know, uh, Clamata Street's unique. West Palm Beach is unique. There are some things that that we know we need to address. You know, there's lots of sidewalk cafes, but our sidewalks are very narrow. Mm -hmm. So if you're in a wheelchair, it's really hard to get down the street. Um, so we want that to be easier for people. And it's really about designing a city for people so that uh, that's, they want to be there. And let's face it, when Clematis was first constructed, that was a century ago. A long time ago. <laughs> Things have changed since then. It's very funny because I've seen some old pictures of um, traffic jams. <laughs> You know, in the 20s, traffic jams on Clematis Street. So, uh, yeah, it's been there a while. And hopefully we'll bring it back, make it better than ever before. Absolutely. All right. Thank you, Mayor, so much. And, again, we're going to put on your screen right now the planning market, again, the green market, from 9 to 1 along Clematis Street. You can give your feedback about the Clematis Streetscape project there, as well as a workshop to be held Monday, January 22nd at City Hall at 5.30 p.m. So please, the mayor wants to hear from you. You have a chance to partake and help make downtown West Palm Beach and Clematis Street something spectacular.